All right, Unboxer Rob here again. Today we will be unboxing the Service Pro 4. Uh, this is, one second, sorry, the i5 model. Um, funny little story, I actually purchased the M3 model and I bought it and I actually did another unboxing on that, but I decided last second, you know what, maybe I should step up to the i5 if this is gonna be a computer that I will use for a while. So here it is guys, here's the Surface Pro 4. If you wanna see the specs, I'll show you right here. It has the i5 processor, 120 by, uh, 125 gigs of SSD, and uh, four gigs of RAM. So it's an awesome thing. It also does not come with the type keyboard, but I purchased that on the side. And what I will say so far, I really enjoy this keyboard, but I will be doing like a better full review uh, in a couple weeks when I actually use the products way more. So let's slide this box open. Actually, I think there's a little tab. Sorry about the lights, guys. I know it's a little bit, uh, it's a little dark out. A little bit shady, but here we go. So you just pull that out. Um, here's that case. There, right there. Um, so here's the box. There's a little tab right here that you pull. Where is it? If I can grab it. Just like that. If you open this compartment, you will find the charger which I will open see, because I actually haven't seen this one, because apparently this one's different. Uh, it's higher voltage for, from, the, from the M3 model. So here it is, here's a pad. So yeah, there, that's the difference right there. Has a little extension, and it has like a kind of like a MacBook, uh, like magnet charge. So magnet safe, which is really awesome, and I will say the charging, the charger did seem pretty good so far. So we open it up, and ta-da. There it is in all of its glory. Um, here's a little, there's a little tab right here you can just pull up. There's a tablet, but we'll put that to the side for one second. See the little goodies inside. There's no Apple stickers. I'm so used to all the Apple stickers. I've been, <laughs> I've been spoiled. Uh, but what you will find in here is a little tutorial book on how you can, uh, how you can use the pen. Uh, just little features on the actual Service Pro. Just your basic stuff. I'm not sure what this one is. Safety, <laughs> safety measures, because you might burn your house down with it. Here's the pen, which is an awesome pen so far. Um, as you can see, I don't know if we can see that. Nice little tip, fine tip. You can see there's a racer right there. If you press it, there's a bunch of different functions you can set it to. Uh, the one function I had it on is if I pressed it, it automatically opens OneNote. And so you can automatically take notes. It takes two seconds to open. There's also another clicker right here at the end of the at the end of the pen right here. And that does a bunch of different functions, including lasso or lasso, lasso, whatever you want to say, however you call it. But there's the pen. Very awesome pen. I have not used the iPad Pro pen yet, but from my experience, it's very high quality. Really nice feeling. And um yeah, I can't really compare it to the iPad Pro because I haven't used it. But from what I've seen, it's awesome. So here's the very satisfactory, satisfactory satisfaction peel of the plastic. And it just slides out just like that. And there it is. So <clears throat> let me just fix up that. Here's the actual thing. And maybe we'll just do a little boot up and see how this thing is. See how long it takes to turn on. Hopefully it has some battery life in it. I know my last the M3 one barely had any battery life. Let's see if that works. There we go. So there we go, we got it working. We'll just see how long it takes to boot up. Wrong way. <laughs> Whatever. Here we go. <laughs> All right, guys. So the boot up is complete, and we are now into the actual computer. So now we're open. We can start writing our names and stuff. Wow, it's super bad. The back of this pen, which is really cool, is the eraser. But Rob.
unbox it rob just like that so thanks for watching guys hope you guys enjoyed there will be way more reviews on this thing in the future that was a terrible r terrible writing excuse my writing so make sure to stay subscribed and tune in for more bye